what are the parameters that you consider when you're scaling up KLA constant KLA so what is KLA it's a oxygen mass transfer coefficient and what is that equal to so KLA it's a coefficient and it is equal to the concentration of oxygen and difference in uh, concentration and then the concentration over time right So right now I have bioreactor are widely used to cultivate cells during the development and manufacturing of modern bio biopharmaceuticals. Cells are very sensitive to changes in the culture environmental conditions such as aeration, agitation, nutrients, and pH. This article discusses the importance of aeration and available options to control the oxygen mass transfer coefficient within a bioreactor and cell culture. Oxygen is a key substrate for growth, production, and maintenance activities. Cells obtain uh, their oxygen in free and non-compound forms called dissolve oxygen uh, in cell culture oxygen is a key substrate for growth production and maintenance activities cells obtain their oxygen in free and non-compound forms called dissolve oxygen one of the most important functions of bioreactors is providing dissolved oxygen to cells continuously through a process called aeration Aeration in the bioreactor typically occurs when oxygen diffuses through through overlay to the culture medium interface. Oxygen from the sparger dissolves in the cell culture through convection with the help of agitation. Ag agitation disperses the oxygen bubbles and promotes mass transfer of the gas bubble through the gas liquid cell culture media interface. The rate of oxygen transfer from gas to liquid interface is a function of physiochemical properties of the cell culture medium, the geometrical parameters of the bioreactor and presence of cells.
due to its uh, low solubility in liquid phase and increasing metabolic uh, consumption by the cells but time oxygen is supplied continuously to the cell culture oxygen supply is carefully controlled for optimal cell growth by manipulating by reactor parameters uh, utility of uh, KLA values evaluating scalability within the same uh, bioreactor platform the conventional uh, scale up of bioprocess is based on physiochemical and geometric similarity KLA is kept constant for this scenario the OTR should remain constant for bioreactor platform Bioreactive physical characteristics at the different scales are altered to provide necessary OTR at control temperature, pH, and DO to achieve the target cell density. During the comparison, KLA is utilized as a target performance metric when, when a process is transferred from one bioreactor platform to another design. Bioreactor hardware design examples, stereo geometry, and aeration as well as option and running parameters, gas flow rate, or or power input are altered to achieve a similar KLA providing a similar cell density. Imagine a gas bubble and liquid. For this discussion, the gas bubble contains oxygen and the liquid in the is the liquid in a bioreactor KLA can be represented by the following equation KLA. KL liquid side mass transfer coefficient and A is the bubble surface. Any change to process and engineering parameters are two physical characteristics will have an impact on KLA and should be considered when evaluating by reactive platforms and performing scaling calculations. Here are four key variables that can affect KLA values gas bubble size. When gas bubble size decreases, surface area and gas residency time increases, causing bubbles to stay in the culture longer. Thus, there is a greater opportunity for oxygen to release mass transfer into the cell culture media medium and increase in this oxygen residence time improve KLA. When gas bubble size decreases, surface area of gas present time increases, causing bubbles to stay in the culture longer, thus there is a greater opportunity for oxygen to release mass transfer into the cell culture medium uh, and increase in the oxygen present time improve KLA. Mixing in a bioreactor mixing is used to eliminate gradients of concentration temperature and other properties mixing time is widely used to characterize mixing efficiency in a bioreactor mixing efficiency is one of the most significant factors affecting both uh, performance and scale up in a bioreactor gas bubble size and residency time are highly dependent upon three mixing conditions impeller type speed and location KLA values generally increase as tip speed increases. However, tip speed is proportional to shear forces that can lead to cell that that's by reactor therefore are designed with different impeller types, combinations, and locations to achieve target KLA value without creating shear forces. Uh, Air flow rate. Higher oxygen availability drives KLA increases. Increasing oxygen supplies to a bioreactor drives this availability and can be controlled by modifying concentration 
Here we're with O2 enrichment and volumetric flow rate. Although high KLA values are desirable, it is important to consider the actual operating conditions and implications to cell viability and associated process costs.